Evening, folks. Fall to Rooibereesht. Putting on the waders here. It's been a beautiful hot day. First of what we might call the summer days. And um, I'm hoping for a bit of dry fly action. Now, whether that will happen or not remains to be seen, but um, I'm more hopeful than I have been in recent times because that bit of heat might generate a bit of activity. So, um, stay with me and let's see how it goes. Well, here we are folks, walking down the bank here, beautiful evening. Ran into my buddy Tom here from home from Australia, planning to catch a massive trout in the dry fly. Alright Tom? That's it Georgie. <laughs> <laughs> right, stay with us. I broke off on him, did I? No. I got him up anyway, yeah, he came <laughs> up. To... The other fellow was around about there, wasn't he? Yeah. Thereabouts. There you go, Georgie. <laughs> <laughs> they like that fly, don't they? Yeah, tell you. Yeah, he's, up, and he's only a handy little lad, but. As you say, a fish is a fish. Yeah. I don't I don't think he's particularly big, but he's fighting particularly hard. He's not small either. Oh yeah, he's a real beauty. Right here, fella. Oh yeah, swallowed my mayfly. Whoop. Yeah, gorgeous. It's late in the evening and um, this is when typically the mayfly come and lay their eggs. The females come and lay their eggs underwater, so the fish are kind of expecting a spent. So that's what I have on. Right. So I didn't actually see him rising at all, I just casting speculatively. Oh yeah, he looks like a nice fish. Oh yes. That was the one I saw rise earlier. <laughs> oh, I really swallowed it. Try and get it out of him now without doing any harm. No fella. 
come up along here because I was way downstream when I spotted a fish rising here and uh, he looks to be a substantial specimen so it's a very high bank here now which makes it difficult from two points of view from the point of view of drag and then if I do hook him to try and land him I'd like him to rise again so I know exactly where he is there he is now oh this guy's a big fish all right oh yeah oh gone brought me that was a serious fish oh my heart is not up to this anymore broke it now as I walked up along I was fairly oh yeah there he is don't know if he's any size or anything, but definitely worth throwing a fly to anyway. There he goes. Now there's a mayfly just past him and he, he left it go. And that's what I actually have on as a mayfly, so he may not have any interest. Oh, he bubbled under it. Yes. Oh shit. He bubbled under it first, then he came up and took it. And for whatever reason I didn't hook him. He looks like a good fish. drag there I think missed again oh shit fuck is going on Yes. 
Ooh. Oh, gone. That's the way it goes. I caught it him anyway. There you are, folks. Dry fly at last. Um, I've been waiting a while for it. Uh, things are really out of kilter, but it's finally arrived. The weather, ha I think, has had a huge adverse effect on fly hatches in general and fish activity up to now. So we've had a couple of hot days in recent times and that has kind of kicked things off, if you like. Now, there weren't mass there wasn't a massive rise or anything or a huge hatch of flies, but it was just enough to keep, keep me entertained. Didn't land them all, as you could see. Missed a couple of nice ones as well, but um, more to come. Really looking forward to the, my favorite, of course, the dry fly. So there'll be more coming shortly. So thanks very much for joining me. If you're not already a subscriber, consider subscribing. Like the video anyway, share it around to anyone whom, to whom you think might be interested in it. And if you'd like to support my channel, which would be um, thankfully acknowledged, um, go to the link in the video description to my Patreon page. So many thanks once again. See you next time. Slán go fall, Biggie slán, I guess, Biggie, I guess,